Welcome to the punishment day of my 2001 Capizzi toilet. Yep, it's from 2001, not 2004, as you can see right there on the tank. So, this could end up being a normal test video. I've got some washcloths and a grocery bag right there. And these are all the things to urge it to do better than it did on the previous test. So, let's start with a washcloth. Now this washcloth is actually a little bit smaller than the one I normally use, so it should have no trouble, right? That was a washcloth. Nothing more, nothing less. So, as I said before, these are the things to urge it not to do that. So, now I will punish it with toilet paper. Got a nice little bit of it in the tank there. Now it's time to stir it up. It's good. Maybe this will teach this toilet not to fail so badly next time. So, let's unclog it. Do better next time. Now let's try the washcloth that it failed in the test video. Maybe it will do better, maybe it won't. Excuse me, what was that? This is supposed to go further than the opening. Thank you. And as you can see, the toilet paper is making itself at home in the tank. Now let's plunge it again. I don't think you're going unpunished for this. Maybe I'll just punish it while it's still clogged. Now let's add some dirt. Do you suppose it'll take it this time? Or will it stay clogged? Is this the only rim jet that works? That's better, but there's still an awful lot of dirt in there. So now, let's try flushing a washcloth again. But let's try the brown one, since it seemed to do better on that. Do I really need to wait for the tank to fill up? Nah, let's try it now. What happened to this toilet? I think that toilet paper must have ruined it. If it wasn't ruined already, because now it can't even flush right. So, I don't know what to do here. I think I'll just throw a rock at it. This is what you get. Learn to flush. So now the tank is almost full. Let's try a grocery bag.
Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What in the world is wrong with this toilet? I guess if it can't be fixed, it can be destroyed. I know in the suggestions, people were saying Chinese fill valve, but this one is just about as useless. That fixed it. Holy cow. Let's try it again. Now let's get this little thing out of here. Let's try a bag again now that I've fixed it. Tank is full enough. You've got to be kidding me. How did this even work? For the 21 years it was installed. How? Let's give it a massage. I don't even need to wait for it to finish flushing. There's no way it could have taken that bag. Happy spa day, Capizzi toilet. Now let's try a washcloth once again. Can it take a washcloth? Now the next punishment for this will be to flush a hard to flush object. If that wasn't hard enough to flush. A snail shell. This is the hard to flush object. A snail shell. My American Standard Albrook could take that. So now let's see if it can take it. Are you kidding me? I think there might be a blockage in the trapway somewhere. I guess there's only one way to find out. What the heck is wrong with you, toilet? Oh, oh, it's fully glazed too. That's really nice. What is wrong with this toilet? And it's still flushing. I'm gonna try plunging it like that's actually gonna help. You're an absolute failure. This is useless. Let's screw it up. It can't even flush anymore, so let's just screw it up. I'm gonna put all these down right into the tank. What a joke. There's no point even testing this anymore. Now it's just time to punish it. 
So let's give it a tattoo. Now I better switch hands since I'm right-handed so I can give it the tattoo it needs. How about right here? Sorry about this, if it hurts your ears, you might want to turn the volume down. And this is why I'm not a tattoo artist. So, now that we're done with that, let's see if it can flush. But now there's broken glass in it. Like I said, that is the only rim jet that works. And this one. But what the heck is wrong with this toilet? I tried to warn you. I'd punish you if you keep this up. And since it doesn't seem to be working right, might as well become a front flusher. That's a little bit better. But did that actually do anything? There we go. There's not even water coming out of the rim. And the flapper is open. What is wrong with this toilet? Well, that just fell off. Oh wow, that's better. I'm gonna see if I can put that part back on and I'll be right back to finish its punishment saw. I'm back after making some repairs to this thing. I just taped that off. Now let's see if it can flush for real. And I'm gonna stand to the side because I have a feeling this is gonna try and spray me. Let's empty all the junk out of it and then see if it can take a washcloth now that it actually flushes. Just need to be careful not to cut myself on all this. Should be good enough. Let's try a washcloth again. Are you kidding me? Also, are you kidding me? What is wrong with this? Everything about it doesn't work. This is pathetic. This is really pathetic. Now the last request for the punishment I got is being punished because of this right here. You see that? This is supposed to go down. It's supposed to go down through the trapway. So the last punishment is to write the F word on the tank, which I will gladly do. So let me dry that tank off because as we know, writing with Sharpie on wet surfaces doesn't work. So I'll be right back. Now we're back. Let's get to writing. Failure.
failure because you're a great big failure. Just look at this. This toilet is pathetic. Let's see if it can flush. Seriously. This calls for some drastic measures. I think that was drastic enough. Now, let's go bowling. Thank mm -hmm. you.